having a biological child as well. So to God be the glory for that. So I wrote this song called She Laughed. And it's a little bit longer than what I'll sing. What I usually sing, I usually just sing the verse in the chorus. Um, this song actually has three verses, and I'm not going to sing all three. I'm going to sing the first verse, the chorus, and then the last, um, the last verse, because the last verse has to do directly with me. And it's called She Laughed, and it goes like this. Barren and cold, a woman so old, she can't hear the truth in his words. The strength that she needs just to conceive, to fulfill a promise foretold. Laughter burst forth, but it wasn't for joy. It echoed with doubt and despair. And just when she broke at the point of a need, the Lord heard and answered her prayers. And she laughed, Sarah laughed. With all of the favor of heaven upon her, she laughed. Yes, she laughed. She brought forth her only son. Hiding my tears, been trying for years. My empty arms quiver there. Bone of my bone, a child of my own. My prayers caused me to lay away. I know he is, so I will not lose heart. Despondency will not prevail. By blood or adoption, my promise will come. My God can do all things but fail. And I'll laugh, I will laugh. With all Upon me I laugh, yes I laugh, and hold tight my sweet child from the Lord. So be encouraged, I am. This is Dr. Naima Johnston Bush from The Refreshing Life with Naima, encouraging you to live a life of exuberant joy, powerful prayer, and sincere gratitude. I am very much moved by that, especially when I did the interview with her over years ago. Thank you, Naomi Bush. Powerful testimony about fertility. And I will trust you, God. Naomi Bush on House of the Gospel Blog Talk Radio. The quality and type of people we have in met and enjoyed and interviewed and talked to over the years. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Love. Love. Love.
You know, I um, I sit here in the um, early morning hours. I've been up ever since about four o'clock in preparation and preparing for this eight year anniversary which God has blessed us with. And I was brought to tears as I listened to Naima sing and praise God. We are a blessed people. And I made some notes, uh, as I said here, that I would trust you, what she's going to do in regards to her fertility. And I said, I wrote a note for myself. We are, you are blessed. Talking about myself and Miss and Mrs. Bush to know God to love each other and have the faith that they have to trust in God. What a powerful testimony. Again, these are the powerful people that we interview and talk to here on How Secret and Gospel Blog Talk Radio. More to come. Our eight year anniversary on How Secret and Gospel Blog Talk Radio. time it is, wherever you are, God is still in control. 2017 is gone. God is still in control, no matter what your situation is. On behalf of all of us here at House of the Gospel Blog Talk Radio, Blog Talk Radio, we've been at it now for 15 years, been on premium host for 8 years. Pay $39 a month too for our ministry. God, we thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. We thank you for all of our listeners, all of our supporters all over the world. We're going to continue to play good music for you. God willing, you'll continue to bless us. Welcome to 2018 at House of and Gospel, Blog Talk Radio. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us, deliver us, Jesus. 